The United States consulate in Nigeria said that the U.S. government will continue to partner with Nigerian universities in an effort to enhance the nation's economy. The U.S. Consul General Will Stevens made the remark during the graduation ceremony of the 10 participants of Learn to Earn project at the American Corner University of Potakot, River State. The United States African Development Foundation has said it has funded a training of 10 young women for a six-month program on how to make sustainable and affordable furniture for African households and industries from reusable materials such as tires and plastic waste. In his remarks, Stevens explained that the aim of this training was to empower young women, reduce pollution, create a healthy environment, as well as provide leadership and business management skills and earn a living. We need to be working together to help find African solutions to global problems. And, <laughs> and, and that is what this is about today. We are here to work together to enable and empower incredible young entrepreneurs like Beauty to find solutions to the problems that plague the entire world. He added that the partnership exchange between the universities in the U.S. and those in Nigeria from the foundation of the people's democratic setting made their relationship vast. The creative director for mobile designs, Beauty Ajayi, thanked the American consulate for the support of young entrepreneurs in Nigeria. Learn to earn entire nature program. Now, when we say learn to earn, it's not just about learning. We're also focused that after the skill acquisition, we have skill acquisition everywhere. But for us, our focus is to say, when you have finished learning, what is the next thing for you? You need to be able to put that skill you have learned into um, activation. On his part, the vice chancellor of the University of Portacourt, Professor Aouneri Georgewill, said that the impact of the training in the American corner was obvious and the combining degrees with skills would produce total manpower in the country. Our world is a way now that certificates alone are no longer enough, degrees alone are no longer enough, but when you combine certificates or degrees with skills, then you produce a total man or a total woman. And so what they are helping us to do here is something that is of, is of tremendous benefits. Some of the beneficiaries expressed gratitude to the U.S. consulate and urged young Nigerians to embrace entrepreneurship training to improve their standard of living. There are so many times where we have people abusing, abusing tires, you know, burning indiscriminately. But here we have been taught how to maximize the use of tires, turning it, turning it into furniture. That's where the name Tire Nature comes in. So it's coined from Tire and Nature. We've gone through leadership training, organizational training, uh, faith-based organizational training, NGO trainings, and a whole lot of it. And I can tell you it's been quite inspiring and educative. I learned one and two. I am as a photographer, I've been able to use what I learned from Tire Nature to put into my photographic business and also to serve my clients and, and, and make the world a better place. Why not? Why don't we use tires to make beautiful things instead of instead of just trashing them? Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.